ethanol subsidies. Um, he would rather open up the foreign market to ag agricultural products. Um, he fully supports American farmers and would like to make it easier for farmers to get their products all around the world. Therefore, he's willing to, um, willing to trade with any country that is willing to lower their barriers to the U.S. Um, un as long as it's under the condition that safety is not compromised. Um, he feels the sh U.S. shouldn't be a protectionist nation because it will isolate the country and hurt the economy. Next, we've got some of the uh, issues for Obama and the health care crisis that's currently going on. Right now, about 16% of the United States GDP is spent on health care, and there's 47 million uninsured Americans. Uh, Obama's, <clears throat> Obama's theory for this is that he wants to provide a national health care system in which that every Mar American is covered by some sort of, whether it be federal or private, insurance. And it'll be something similar to the plan of congressmen and what they and what they roll in for health care. And Obama also plans to cut income taxes by up to, I believe it's $1,000 for middle income families. Uh, he essentially wants to eliminate the income tax altogether for working Americans. Now, a little more expansion on McCain's health care policies. Uh, he too wants a national health care and he wants to, he wants the families to be able to choose whether they go with a federal uh, insurance institution or private and there'll be a refundable tax credit that will go directly to the insurance company to pay for the family's <coughs> insurance and if there's anything it'll be twenty five hundred to five thousand dollars roughly and if there's anything left over it'll go directly into an HSA which is a health savings account and McCain also something that's different from McCain uh, compared to Obama is that he wants to be sure that high-risk people like you know someone with cancer or smokers or you know somebody that has a terminal illness can also 